Hi, today we're going to be unboxing a couple of memory sims and putting them into this wonderful EVGA SR2 classified motherboard. So I purchased uh, these things from Newegg and we have two of these boxes. Each one is 12 gigabytes, so there's going to be a total of 24 gigabytes of RAM put on this motherboard. So let's take a look at what these are. So this is actually from Patriot Memory and they're the Viper Extreme kind, the DDR3, and it's 1600 megahertz, and these are PC3 uh, 12800 uh, uh, memory modules. So this is a kit for 12 gigabytes, so it's got three 4 gigabyte sticks. So let's take a look at what they look like. So here they are. Ooh, nice and shiny. Wow, check it out. So, these actually can be overclocked beyond what this motherboard can handle. That's the reason why I got them. Here we go. And as you can see, each one has a lot of copper and heat sinks right on them. So, they're very, very nice heat dissipation there. So you have the copper inside and the big, thick uh, metal bracket that goes around it. So let me undo the memory sockets here. And actually when I put them in, I have to put them in in triple because these are triple channel memory. So I need to put them in sockets one, three, and five. Otherwise, we're gonna be in deep trouble. So uh, let me put these off uh, so I know which ones are one, three, and five. There we go. So let me take out the sticker. Okay, and then take one of the memory sims and put them into socket number one. And there's actually only one way to put them in, which is helpful. So I'm going to put them in the correct way. Let's stick one side and then the other side. And as you heard, it snaps in place. So that's a four gigabyte stick. Here's another four gigabyte stick. And I'm gonna put that into socket number three. That's one side. That's the other side. I'm just gonna close it just to be safe. And then the last of the three, putting in socket number five. Okay, let me close that off. That's one side, and that's the other, okay. So that's actually a total of 12 gigabytes in triple channel mode. And these, this a bunch of memory is going to be for this particular socket, uh, CPU socket, which is CPU zero or the primary CPU socket. Now I'm going to open this up and do the same thing for the second CPU socket. So let me open this up. And here are three more. How cool is that? All right, now, let me open this up. Okay, now, uh, one, three, and five is for triple channel memory. So let me open those up. So I know which ones they are. Let me take the nice EVGA sticker off, because I don't need the sticker anymore that down and here we go this is slot number one and of course it doesn't matter which order we put them in but I like to be safe and put them in the right order so that's slot number one and slot number three that's one side And then finally, slot number five. So the last one. That's one side, and that's the other side. Okay, so that's as far as the memory is concerned. to do our next step in the video. So thanks for watching 
and see you soon.